Megan here with the McBride Real Estate Group at Keller Williams doing a quick two minute market update for April 2022. In Evansville, the average sales price was $194,041. That's a decrease just a little bit of a $3,900 from last month. Average days on market went down as well, went down about six days, and homes sold went down a little too, about four. Average sales price did fall, so did average days on market. Homes that are priced right are still moving quickly. 210 homes sold with no price change, and they sold at 102% of asking price. Um, and they sold within five days. Average days on market was five days. 28 homes sold with one or more price changes, and they sold at 91% of that decreased asking price. Um, and the average days on market increased to 57. In April 2021, 263 new homes came on the market. In April 2022, 294 new homes came on the market. So that's 31 more homes were listed this month than this month last year. In April 2021, 209 homes sold. In April 2022, as we see, 238 homes sold. That's 29 more homes sold this year, this month, than it did in April of 2021. So it's hard to say that we're going into a bad market recession when homes are still selling at 102% of asking price. Um, in Newburgh, Newburgh, of course, like I say, is doing what it does. Average sales price was $338,774. That's an increase of $37,000 for the month. That's Newburgh. Average days on market was 11. That's down a little bit, seven days. Homes sold 66, which is up um, 21 of what sold last, last month. In April, um, 57 homes sold with no price change at 102% of asking price with average days on market being seven. Nine homes needed one or more price changes and they sold at 91% of asking price with average days on market increasing to 38. So only the real difference between Evansville and Newburgh is that um, average days on market in Newburgh after the price change is a little bit lower. In April 2021, 54 homes sold. In April 2022, 12 more homes sold than the previous year, 66. In April 2021, 87 new homes were listed, and in April 2022, 76 new homes were listed. So that's a decrease of about 11 homes. Um, if you have any questions about this market update or what's going on in your market, and if this is still a good time for you and your personal situation to buy or sell, getting educated is what's going to help you make those decisions. And sometimes just knowing where to start is the hardest step. Please always reach out to me at 812-205-8270.